My name is Alejandra, but everyone here on the Skittle Solar Car team for New Brent High School calls me Hana. I first joined last year as a junior because one of my really good friends is our very good captain, Dylan Yat. And he came over one day and was like, you know what, I'm part of this really cool club and it'd be awesome if you join, I think you would really enjoy it. I kind of looked at him and went, I don't know anything about engineering, I'm going to go, it's going to be boring, I'm not going to like it. But he's very persuading, so he convinced me to come to a couple of meetings and after a while I realized that it was absolutely nothing like I expected. There were so many things for everyone to do, there's fundraising, there's doing stuff with the car, there's spirit, and there's research, and really everyone on the team is so nice, and we're all really, we've all become really good friends, so everyone just teaches you things, and now I know so many things that I didn't know, and actually because of the program and our advisors, Mr. Willett and Mr. Wallens, and everyone on the team, I've decided that I want to be a biomedical engineer. So I've learned a lot, and it's just a really good experience, and our team is really, really, really like a, a solid group, and it has just been wonderful, and I'm really glad that he pretty much forced me to join. Hi, my name is Donya. I'm one of the captains of New Britain High School Solar Car Team, and uh, I joined early, um, early on, I joined as a sophomore. One of my teachers was like, you know, hey, we got this uh, solar car, I think you should try it, and I was like, that, that's crazy. So. Um, I got involved and I was like, wow, like this is really cool. Like I'd always like math and science. I was like always like a huge geek, but it's awesome. So whatever. Um, yeah, I, I love it. I, I like I love this and I got involved and I was like, you know, wow, this is really cool. And not only was it a lot of like math and science, but it was also you know a lot about leadership, making friends, organization. Like it was like it was everything. Like this is like a total package. This is like life in a club, you know, life six hours a week after school. And uh, well, um, like I said, I, I've always been a math science person, but what really got me interested in, in like the engineering aspect, like the problem solving was um, when we were in Texas, Texas this past year and um, our voltmeter wasn't working and we had to get the car out on the track the next day. And so um, I was sitting on the ground, actually you know, right about here, but you know, in Texas, next to the car, and I saw a Powerade bottle, which is that drew right here, and it was just like inspiration. I, I immediately came to me, you know, like, why don't we cut a hole in a Powerade bottle, put a voltmeter in it, and then just strap it right to the car so it's right where the driver could see it. And you know, so we did it, we got it working, the judges were actually really impressed. They're like, wow, that's pretty cool. And so, like, yeah, that was my personal victory, and it's what's really got me into engineering because you know that's it's really interesting it's always changing there's always new problems you always have to find new solutions so that's really got me interested in engineering that's why I recommend engineering classes for you know uh, all the underclassmen anyone I know I recommend that because like the problem-solving experience is like nothing else hi I'm Maggie I'm a junior at Newburn High School I started a solar car when I was a freshman and I loved it ever since because I learned a great deal about leadership, organization, and the most important thing, I, um, I started to love engineering. Like, it's a great experience because you get, like, you get hands-on instead of just learning from books. And the most exciting part about it is you actually build a solar car that runs on solar power. And we went to Texas and raised. And the great thing about it was, um, it's it's more of like you learn a lot more like from the other teams they've been there for longer they like we're a new team so we learn more about the car and it's great because <laughs> it gave me a whole new experience on like engineering and science and technology hi i'm Alicia Banchik. i'm a senior at new Bern high school and i'm on the new Bern high solar car team and it's a really good experience for you. Like I recommend it to everyone, all my friends, and new freshmen, and everyone. Like it's awesome. But yeah. So to be honest, I wasn't gonna join, but my friend came down to me and was like, "Oh, hey, you should join this team." I was like, "Oh, what do you do?" Well, we build a solar car. A solar car? Yeah, sure. Liar. So she's like, "Don't believe me? Go down, look at it." So I did. They had like only a frame, really. But I was like, oh, you guys are actually doing this. This is serious. So I joined, and same week, I was 
like welding, working on the drill press, working on the lathe, stuff I never ever thought I would do. But it was really rewarding in the end. Like I got to go down to Texas. I met great new people. I learned so many things. Like I now want to become a mechanical engineer. I never thought I would want to do that. And as far as like life and like lessons, well, I guess you could say I messed up a lot of course. Don't think I'm perfect. Car broke like 20 times, who knows? I'm not counting. And, but each time, you know, you learn from it, you like fix it, and you know like next time not to do that again, but you know, do this instead. And it just relates to life, you know, don't give up ever, because you will succeed if you try. So, bye. <laughs> Hi, my name is Tom Ortiz. Um, I'm a member of uh, the MBHS Solar Car, and I joined a couple years ago because I was hearing about it from my friends, and I was really excited because I, I hadn't started out to be an engineer in my career, but it, it had always fascinated me. So I started looking into it in earnest, and so I got here, and I was shocked by the amount of people. I mean, just just genuine, charismatic people who were working on this, you know, for hours at a clip, and I realized there's something. There's a genuine intrigued to this because here you are working with a device and you're trying to wrap your mind around it and it was really absolutely fascinating so I spent more and more time helping out here and there at first doing grunt work and then doing some higher level stuff and I, I fell in love with it so yeah and I, I strongly encourage anyone who's, who's remotely interested in how things work and just general mechanics to check it out because engineering is awesome it's in it makes up the human experience in the contemporary world so yeah